We might do a catch and cook on the flounder. Some of the best eating fish right here. Hello, good morning, beautiful people. How you guys doing? It's Sunday. It's that time of the week. We about to hit the Surfside Park at Delano Beach. The winds have finally calmed down. I wanted to go yesterday actually, but the winds were too much to handle. And uh, today looks a little bit better. So we're gonna go and check it out. See what the beach has to offer today. This is it. This is our spot. Small parking lot, but rarely anyone comes here. You can tell the fishing guys park right here. We have the access, which makes it very easy. Yeah, I'm not impressed. The surf is turned up. Look at all this white wash. Yeah, this is not gonna work out for today. Well, that wasn't good. There's plenty of places that you can fish in St. Augustine. Plenty of places. But the thing is, I love the surf, you know? So it's okay. We'll find a different spot, you know? We may not have the room and the fun that you have at the surf, but we're gonna get on fish. And these other places, they may have bigger fish than the surf. So we may have a better eating today. So it won't be as exciting as the surf, but we're gonna get on some fish. I'm gonna make you guys a video. I'm gonna show you my other spot and we'll go from there. This is our other spot. Right here. Look at the sunrise. Excuse the music. See that? All calm. We're definitely gonna get on some fish here.
Check out the flounder, baby. Woo! Look at this bad boy. Man, that's a good size. Look at this guy, 16 inches, definitely a keeper. A keeper flounder, baby. We might do a catch and cook on a flounder. Some of the best eating fish right here. Well, we eating flounder today. Flounder for lunch, baby. Gotta love it. This area right here is full of oyster beds. So you get tangled when you're reeling in to rebate. So that's what I was doing. I was just reeling in to rebate my hooks. And I thought I got snugged on one of those oyster beds. Check it out, guys. Now flounder has to be at least 14 inches. So this one is at 16. So yeah, if they're under 14, you gotta put them back. And for the for you guys that are new in fishing and haven't seen a flounder, look at this. See how they're white underneath? Very, very camouflagey. Can't see this guy under there. This is how they attack. They blend in. Look at those teeth. Oh yeah. So you guys get an idea. This is what I'm fishing under. See, that's my lure. This is where I got that This is where I got that flounder right here under these rocks. He was camouflaged in, I couldn't even see him. But he saw my bait and he went for it. That's the struggle when you're fishing in structure, oyster beds, rocks. You get snugged and you get cut off. Straight to the house, from the beach, it's time to cook that flounder, so stay tuned, excuse the mess in my kitchen. Alright, well, we scaled them. On both sides, we gutted him out. Now, what we want to do is cut some lines on him, just like this. Look at all that meat. Look at all that white meat right there. Oh yeah. Look 
Okay. Got to get the butter. There we go. What you want to do is fill this bad boy with butter and lemon. Just like that. Just like that. See that? This is what you want to do. Here we go. Ready for the grill. We got the grill on. Go. Now remember, I'm not here to sell you anything. But I do use the grill mats. This is the best for fish. No stick. Look at this beauty. Just a little bit longer. We'll put some salt and some pepper. Well, the fishing regulation, salt water, 2023, guess what's on the picture? A flounder. There we go. This explains it. Minimum size 14 inches, 5 per harvest. Now, it's a closed season between October 15th till November 30th. So, you always got to keep that in mind. Gigantic. Mm -hmm. Looking good. Delicious. And we got the ducks right there. They give us some company. Here it is. The finished product. Look at that white meat. No bones. Mm. Yummy. To die for. <laughs> if you haven't tried a flounder before, you must try the flounder. This is my goodness. Mm. Living the dream, guys. Living the dream. Cheers. And stay tuned to the next video.